Hey cat lovers and welcome back to another video. Last week we shared my first impressions of Stray, which is a fairly new cat video game. I asked you guys if you wanted me to continue a playthrough, and the vast majority of you said yes, so here we are again. If you missed the first part, feel free to check out that video first. Now let's continue on with this cat adventure. Yeah, that's right, we were in the apartment building. What's this? Oh my god, am I kneading? Oh my god, I'm scratching up the carpet. Oh my god, I'm scratching up the carpet. That's so adorable. But also very destructive. They they definitely have down what cats like to... Oh no. Wait, can I... Oh, that's not dangerous at all. So there's got to be some sort of puzzle I got to do, I guess. What do I do here? Need help. Oh. Oh, I get it. I'm like writing on the keyboard. Data corrupted and need help. Oh, there's a little, there's a little uh, smiling cat on the side. Oh, that's adorable. Enter the door, turn on, find a body. What? Find a body? What does that mean? All right. I have completed my objective, I guess. What's this? Can I grab this? All right, and this is really one smart cat, I have to say. Oh, what is this? Uh, I guess I gotta take out this battery, and then do I have to put it somewhere? Is there multiple? Oh, there's multiple batteries I gotta get, I guess. Oh, here we go. So then there's that one. Is there another one somewhere? Yes, there is. I see you up there. Yep. No, put put in the thing. There we go. And the last one is up here. There we go. The cameras are looking at me, which has me a little bit afraid. I still cannot get over how adorable this little thing is. She's so cute. Oh, secret door. Hello? What in the world? I gotta jump on this thing? Okay, and then knock this off. Okay. What is this? Oh, okay. I put it here, I guess? What in the world? Is that like a little robot? Oh, I guess he doesn't have enough power. Oh, he's kind of cute. Hello. <laughs> oh, it's talking to me? It worked. I'm free. Thank you. I couldn't believe the cameras. A cat in the dead city? I'm... I can't remember my name. It seems my memory is corrupt. I've been trapped in the electronic network for so long. I know I worked for a scientist who lived here. For now, you can call me B12. That's what I... that's what it says on my exterior. It's dangerous in the dead city, but you seem like you know how to handle yourself. Well, I am a cat. Let's get out of here. Follow me. So a cat and a robot are teaming up. This is the greatest team up of all time. The key unlocks the door. I remember that much. Let me get that for you. Oh, very good. Battery low already. Come over here. Where's over here? You're going to have to put this on. What, put, how do I put it on? What the? Oh, it's like a little thing. So is he like inside of my... Is he in this little backpack now, I guess? I probably don't like... He probably doesn't like this being on him that much. This backpack was designed for small quadrupeds like you. Why was it designed specifically for that? Is this comfortable for you? 
<laughs> I don't think so. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. I've digitized the key and stored it in the backpack. How? We need to open inventory. Oh! What? Stop exi- Okay, interesting. Easy. If you're ever curious about an object, you can show it to me. Or to others, if we come across any. Now let's get out of this flat. Sure. How do we go about doing that, exactly? Read. Oh! It's written, I hope this will work. Oh, so I have a little robot buddy with me. Now, how do we get out of here? Uh, how do we get out of here? Oh, wait, he could probably open up the door now. That's so cool. Oh, so this is interesting. Ready to use torchlight. Oh, a cat with a flashlight. Oh, wait, hold on. I see what I have to do here. I had to. I had to do it. Oh, this is so cool, but also kind of... I feel like this is going to get terrifying very fast with this. Can you... Oh, I don't know the code. Oh, maybe the code's in here somewhere? Oh, here we go. Code. Three... Three, seven, four, eight. Three, seven, four, eight. That's what it, that's what it looks like to me. Three, seven, four, eight. Aha! There we go. Okay, if this game didn't already sell me, the fact that I'm a cat with a robot is even better. Hmm, what's that? Wow, look at this place. That elevator in the distance, that's important, I think. What ele- Oh, I see it. I know we need to go up. Okay, fair enough. Oh, here we go. Woohoo! Bucket ride! Oh, this is so... Oh. That doesn't look good. Wait, I remember. The outside. It feels like I've been there before. Is this where you came from? Not nah, maybe. I promised someone I would go there. Promised who? This postcard. The mural was painted from it. Let's take it. Okay. Why do I have these memories? How did they get here? Let's keep going. So we're in some sort of like uh, cordoned off city and there's like an outside area that people can go to it looks like. Maybe that's why there's no one here. He did say this place was called the dead city so I guess it kind of makes sense why there wouldn't be anybody here. If that's what it's called. But then how did it get dead? Oh another ride. Oh, I don't like this. Yeah, those things. Oh! Guessing I need to run? I'm running. Yeep. I really don't like those things at all. <gasps> Wait, is that... Is that a person? The slums. Alright, well that's fair. Hello. Oh, you're a robot. Hi. Hello. Whoa, what? Why'd you start on the alarm? I'm just I'm just a cat. Oh, I don't like this. Okay. Whoa, that's scary. Hi. What are these people not like cats? What is this a dog friendly city? Hello. You don't have to be afraid. Why are they all so afraid of me? What's going on here? It's okay. All I want to do is be your friend. Okay, that's a lot of... They seem to have their own language. You're no Zerk. We're not familiar with your kind. You are welcome in our village as long as you don't eat anyone. I don't intend on doing any of that, so... Nope. I come in peace. I don't, I'm not going to eat anybody. 
Unless you guys have like a mouse problem, in which case I might do that. So this city is entirely inhabited by robots? Or I guess Zerks is what they're called, because that's what the guy said. You look lost. What do you need? Uh, show item. Oh, the picture of the outside. Ridiculous. This elevator isn't operational. Everyone knows that it's impossible to leave this place. Well, except the outsiders. But they're all gone now, except Momo. You can try to talk to him if you want, but he gave up on trying to leave. It's for the best. He lives up high in the building with the orange neon sign. That one? Alright, I guess we gotta find this Momo guy. Don't hesitate to call me anytime. I'm here to help. The Guardian told us to talk to Momo in the big building with the orange neon sign. He's the only lead we've got for getting- yeah, I, I, I got that part. Definitely getting big dystopian society vibes. Like, that's definitely what I'm getting from this. Okay, so we just gotta, like, try to climb our way to the top, it looks like. Thankfully, as a cat, I am a master of the climbing art. Those circles of light are pleasing to watch, but I want to see the real sky one day. Wait. What? Hold on. What? Outside, Momo told me he'd get me there one day. Wait a minute, this isn't the real... What in the world? Are we like in some sort of contained area? Oh, I didn't even realize that. We're in some sort of like shelter area. Alright, well, I guess I'll keep working my way trying to find this Momo guy. Hello, are you Momo? Hello. It's never going to work. Why did I let them go? I'm all alone now. Hey you, what do you want? That's a picture of the outside. Do you want to go there? Well, don't bother. It's a waste of time. It will bring you only loneliness and despair. My friends had this dream too, but now they're gone and I'm all alone. I don't know where they ended up. I tried to contact them, but that transceiver doesn't work. My friends and I took notes of our research about the outside. Here, take mine if you really want to go there. Thank you! You're on your own. I'm done with the outside. Good luck. Momo seems very sad. He misses his friends. Let me check the notebook he gave us. The, outside mani the Outsider's Manifesto. We must go outside at any cost. We must protect our brothers and sisters. We must stay away from Zerks. It is signed Clementine... I'm not even going to try to pronounce that one. Doc and Momo. It looks like Momo's name was added later. I think we should find the other notebooks. Does he have any way that we can... Are you still looking for those useless notebooks? Well, yeah, can you show me it? I'm also the last remaining one. <laughs> oh, this is so great. What's this? Oh, it's a ball! <gasps> I can play with the ball! I, you know what, you know what, what the, oh, my controls are reversed now, <laughs> that's so great, <laughs> oh, this is the greatest game ever made, oh, and it just fell off, but that is, this is fantastic, the developers really love making these cats feel like they're real cats, and the fact that they just mess with everything. Oh, Back Home 2. I remember this video game. It was made just after I was created, I think. I can't remember it very well. Scientist and I spent a lot of time playing it. It was fun. I miss him. Why can't I remember his name? I guess I'm gonna be collecting a lot of his mem- Ooh, I can hide under the bed. Oh. The symbol on the wall matches one of the nope. Oh, that's the symbol. Okay. So I guess we gotta go over there next. Fair enough. That seems like a lead. I agree, little buddy. I agree. Eee. God, the scenery is just always fantastic. So the ability to jump on everything is just so much fun. I feel like if anybody's ever played the Assassin's Creed games, it's like that, but you're a cat. And that just to me is awesome. 
All right, so this is the other apartment that we have to look at. This looks like a place that a journal would be. Aha! Got one. An outsider notebook. It's the same logo as the one Momo gave us. This one seems to belong to someone named Clementine. Everything is going according to plan. We managed to contact the upper levels before the transceiver went down. They are in a place called Midtown, and apparently it's controlled by some kind of oppressive force. I talked to Momo earlier. His eyes. I know this look. He will not come with us. Let's find the other notebooks. Okay. So something... There's some sort of, like, crazy, oppressive, I'm guessing, government force or something like that going on that makes the outside world horrible which is why this dead city exists because it gives people i guess some sort of safe haven which is why i guess it's inside i didn't even realize the fact that we were inside i just thought that it was just nighttime the whole entire time we were here but that's crazy to think about let's see what is in this one books oh hello translate how to develop your artificial intelligence order to be as creative as a real human. Volume 42. What? Oh, piano time. What is this? <gasps> I found a spot to nap! Oh. <gasps> and you can meow while napping! This is without a doubt the greatest thing that has ever been created all right let's go look for this other journal oh guessing it's through here hey doc i found the keys of your safe you need to be more careful with these gain new item hey it's not enough to bury your safe behind a bunch of books just the librarian so behind where a bunch of books are well that doesn't really narrow it down considering the fact that we're in a library but I suppose I have to... Oh, wait a minute. I have to. The fact that they actually added this in is just insane, and it's so great. Maybe it's not here? Maybe I have to go to another building and find it. I might try that. Oh, wait. Hold on. These are alphabetical. So maybe if I go to where... The D section is. No, that doesn't look about right. Maybe I need to go to another building. I'm going to stop there for today. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing more of this game. If you are interested in Stray, we'll have a link in the description box below. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you next Catterday for another video.